Mama's a mean mama. Baby's a bad baby. Papa's a poor papa. Red leather, yellow leather. Red leather, yellow leather. Scene. Welcome to 100 Chatterton Way, the latest and greatest by Custom Homes of Recovery Construction. house was built in the 50s it was a fire we got it for the right price it's got a huge scope of work it's gonna cost a lot of money Warren's extremely nervous we got the dumpsters and the demo guy starting today project starts today it's beautiful it's bright it's gonna be perfect the fire was in the kitchen so essentially all the framing for the roof has to be redone all the rafters the way the house is set up is it's flanked by residences on each side on the right hand side here is the guest bedrooms and on the left hand side is the master suite and the, what Warren and I had talked about doing was opening up the middle of the house to create this really grand open floor plan. If you're not using fireplaces, yes you need a flue to get rid of gas, smoke, air, air in, sort of what a chimney does even if you're not using it. But because everything's been, become so modernized you can actually bypass that. So if we have to, we can get rid of this chimney. We have the flat part here, the flat part here, and then maybe something super dramatic in the middle. The rose is a rose by any other name. Every rose has its thorn. Well, the boys at Recovery Construction got their hands full with this one. I sure hope Warren can hold it together. When we go inside, you're going to see why he didn't want to deal with this house anymore. Welcome to 100 Chatterton. Go ahead, Steve. Cue the music. <laughs> Kate did call him. So all of this gone. You think we'll be able to stain this out? Yeah, so probably. We're gonna put LBLs in and okay. open up from this side all the way to the other side of the kitchen. I think we can keep the cabinets. Ah, beautiful. We'll keep the same pitch, mm -hmm. but we're gonna frame it out with two by twelves so we can put insulation in there and then drywall to the ceiling. Oh yeah. Yeah. So this is the master suite. Got it. All the time wall. Blah, 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 blah. We're probably going to take the weight. Mattel, mm -hmm. yes. We for it You know that. Here's the other master suite. Here's our other full bath. Got it. Oh, it's one bathroom. Very confused, puppy. You were right. I hate that. There's a back door over here. Close this off. Make this a wall. We'll build a wall here. This will be the office or a sitting room for the master suite, and then that way you can walk from the back door all the way into the main room. Yeah, right there. Ah! So they obviously had a leak. They used kitty litter uh, to get rid of the oil smell, and if oil spills, and this is the for the well, this is the pump over here. If the pump turns on, we may be able to use the toilets and stuff, but we, we just don't know that yet. We're putting a new water heater, new TV. Uh, is that a wall mounted? Sure. It's like a EKG machine. So demo starts today. It's at least five days of demo. We really just got an exploratory permit for demolition so that we could go back and pull another permit for what we're actually going to do when the, we see what's actually left as we're done demoing. Got the house, build the walls, and bring the mechanicals into the walls, meaning the electrical, the plumbing, and the HVAC. Because of the fire, everything is compromised. The whole house has to be rewired, replumbed. And we talked to our HVAC guy about getting in forced air, maybe just converting the entire furnace uh, oil tank system into gas only because that's really attractive to potential new buyers. Adding the bathroom up here. Oh yeah, that's a good idea. The chimney, what do we do with the chimney? Can we yeah. work around it or do we need to keep it? Yeah, ideally we'd like to have it ready by September or October, the fall market, because um, if we can't have it ready by then, I don't think people put it up in the winter. Recovery Construction is chomping at the bit to get this fire restoration and house flip underway. Stay tuned as Warren and Matt still have some big decisions to make about this house. They need to figure out what they're going to do with the chimney and the fireplace, and they also need to figure out what they're going to do with all this asphalt that wraps around the entire house. 